Hello everyone and in today's video I'm going to be talking about Spain. This is the flag of Spain, a pretty famous flag. And in case you didn't know, it is right here. It sits in the Iberian Peninsula. And this is the coat of arms. Spain, formerly the Kingdom of Spain, Spanish Reino de España, is a country in southwestern Europe with some pockets of territory in the Mediterranean Sea. Offices in the Atlantic Ocean and across the Strait of Gibraltar, Gibraltar, it is continental European territory is situated on the Iberian Peninsula and its in in secular territory includes the Balearian Islands in the Mediterranean Sea, several small islands in the Alboran Sea, and the Canary Islands in the Atlantic Ocean. The Spanish territory also includes the African semi exclusive of Ceuta, Melilla, and Penon de Velez across the Strait of Gibraltar. Gibraltar. I don't know why I'm having a difficult time saying it. The country's mainland is bordered by the south and southeast by the Mediterranean Sea, to the north by France, Andorra, don't forget it, Andorra, and the Bay of Bisay, and to the west by Portugal and the Atlantic Ocean. With an area of 550,990 square kilometers, 195,360 square miles, Spain is the largest country in Southern Europe, the second largest country in Western Europe, and the and the European Union, and the fourth largest country by area of the European Union continent, with a population exceeding 47.3 million people. Spain is the sixth most populous country in Europe, and the fourth most populous country in the European Union. Spain is Spain's capital and the largest city is Madrid. Other major urban areas include Barcelona, famous Barcelona, Valencia, Sevilla, Zagreb. Zaragoza, Malaga, Murica, Palma de Barcelona, Les Palmas de Gra Canaria, and Biblia. Sorry for my pronunciation, I don't speak Spanish. Maybe Italian, and it's quite similar. This Spain, Spanish is quite similar to it Italian, but still, I have a hard time saying words. A very beautiful picture of. Barcelona, I guess. I don't know. Barcelona, Madrid. And this, which is in Barcelona, I guess. I don't know. I'm very confused with Barcelona and Madrid, even though they're two different things. This is a very beautiful, famous church, which is going to have to be completed in 2029, I guess. These were the sources of like three or four years ago, but thanks to COVID 19, things have shut down, so it might take a longer, a little longer. They said that the church has been trying to be made for like more than 200 years ago. I don't know if it's true or not, but it is nearly said that the church has nearly taken more than 200 years to be built. But I guess that was totally worth it. Just look at a picture of it, it looks beautiful. Spanish physical geography at 555,992 square kilometers, 153,965 square miles. Spain is the world's la world fifth second, fifth second, fifth second largest country and Europe's fourth largest country. It is home to 47,000. 18,000 square miles smaller than France and 81,000. 31,000 square miles larger than the U.S. state of California. Mount Teide, Tenerife, is the highest mountain peak in Spain and is this, the largest la, largest volcano in the world from its base. Spain is a transcontinental country having territories in both Europe and Africa. On the, on the west, Spain is bordered by Portugal to the abrid. Of course, it is bordered by Gibraltar, a British overseas territory in Morocco, to its exclave in North Africa, Ceuta and Melilla, and its peninsula of Velas de la Gormera on the northeast along the Pyrenees mountain range. It is bordered by France and Dora along the Pyrenees in Girona. A small exclave town called Libiva is surrounded by Fasa. Here we have a very beautiful beach. 
town of Spain. Um, this is the geography of Spain. As we can see, the majority of Spain is mountainous, except the western part and the southwestern, which seems the most green and less. Demographics. In 2013, the population of Spain officially reached 47 million people, as recorded by the Padron Munin City, Spain Munin City Register. Spain population density at 91 per kilometer, 235 square miles, is lower than, than most Europe, Western European countries, and its distribution across the country is very unequal. With the exceptions of the regions surrounding the capital, Madrid, the most populated areas lie around the coast. The population of Spain has risen to one slash two times since 19th century, 20th century, when it stood at 18.6 million people, principally due to the spectral demographic boom of the 1960s and early 1970s. In 2017, the average suit of fertility rate across Spain was 1.33 children per woman, one of the lowest in the world, below the replacement rate of 2.1. It remains considerably low, the with below the high 5.11 children born per woman in 1865. Spain subconsciously has one of the oldest population in the world with an average age of 43.1 years old. These Spaniards make up 88% of the pop total population of Spain. After the birth rate plummeted in the 1980s, the Spain population growth rate has dropped. The population again trended upwards initially upon the return of many Spaniards who had immigrated to other European countries during the 1970s and more recently fueled by large numbers of immigrants who make up 12% of the population. Immigrants originate mainly in Latin America, 39%, North Africa, 16%, mostly in Morocco, Eastern Europe, 15%, mostly from Romania, Bulgaria, and Sub Saharan Africa, 4%, mostly from Nigeria. Niger, Cameroon, mostly these countries. In 2005, Spain instituted a three month amnesty program throughout which certain hitherto hit undocumented aliens were granted legal residency. Weird, very weird. He may have a population graph rate. Uh, you get the point, you know, what is it probably? And we can see this is the highest. Well, old population pretty low, but yeah. Spain's autonomous communities are the first level administrative divisions of the country. They were created after the current constitution came into effect in 1978 in recognition to the right to self govern of the nationalities and regions of Spain. The autonomous communities were to comprise adjacent provinces with common historical, cultural, and economic traits. Their territory organization based on devolution is known in Spain as the State of Autonomies. The basic institution law of each autonomous community is the State of Autonomy. The statutes of autonomy stabilize the name of the community according to its historical and contemporary identity. The limits of his territory is the name and organization of the institution of government and the rights and enjoy according to the constitution, Catalonia, Galicia, and Basque Country, which identify themselves as national were granted self government through a rapid process. Andalusia also took the denomination in its first days of autonomy, even though even though it followed the long longer process stipulated in the constitution for the rest of the country progressively other communities in revision in the status of autonomy have also taken the denomination in accordance to the historical and modern identities such as Valencian community, the Canary Islands, the Balearian Islands and Argonne. Here we have a distribution of Spanish population as we can see Madrid is the most populous followed by this area in Catalonia. This area, I guess, in Basque Country and southern areas in Andalucia, Galicia, and Balearic Islands, and places like that. Well, this area, which is considered the poorest area in Spain, is also have a very low population and overall the most of central Spain. Here we have all of the autonomies of Spain, this is Catalonia, this is Basque Country, somewhere between, between Madrid, Andalucia, Galicia, Argon, Valencia, Leon, 
Madrid and I don't remember its name sorry and in terms of religion 57.4 percent of the population identify as Christian mostly Catholic uh, and surprisingly high 38.9 percent non-religion 2.5 percent error and 1.3 percent were unanswered this is pretty surprising i knew like the areas like france germany are pretty religious but i know that spain is like a very religious country you fought a lot of religious wars a lot of churches are there apparently and you know but apparently in more than one fourth of the Spain population are actually atheists or just agnostic Okay, so this is the population of Spanish people. As you can see, the majority of Spaniards. No, there's the Spanish and Spaniard, and majority of them live in Spain, followed by most of Europe, uh, USA, Canada. Oddly enough, they live also in Angola. Even though Angola is a Portuguese colony, not a Spanish one. They don't seem to live in Equatorial Guinea, which they actually colonized. Uh, their government is unitary parliamentary constitutional monarchy. Their king is Philip the Fourth. Their prime minister is Pedro Sanchez. President of the Congress of Deputies is Mattel Batan. President of the Senate is Andrew Gil. The president of the Supreme Court is Carlos Lemes Serrano. Their upper house is Cortes Generals and their lower house is Congress of Deputies. Uh, let's see more, let's see more. Okay, so they were formed in 20th January in 1479. Their de is 9th January 1715. I don't know what happened that time. First Constitution, 19 March 1812. Francois Spain, 1st April 1939 to 1978. It, okay, so these areas, Greece, Turkey, Spain and Portugal at one time were actually dictatorships like Belarus, I guess. Maybe even worse than that. But apparently they also joined the European Union. Uh, NATO, NATO, sorry. And also the European Union, except Turkey. Current Democracy, 29th December 1978, and their EEC assessment 1st January 1986. And their growth rate is the fifth, their total GDP is the 15th largest with 1.942 trillion, while their per capita is 41,796 at 32th. Does not seem very high, not gonna lie. But at least it is better than the neighboring Portugal. The Gini is unfortunately 33%, which is medium. The HDI is very high, 25% 25 in the world. Time zone is UTC 2, 0, 2 plus 1, wet and CET. Summer UTC plus 1, 2 plus 2, west and chest. Note, most of Spain observes CET and CST, except the Canary Island, which observe wet slash west. The calling code is thir plus 34, just in case you want to call a Spaniard. The internal e dot ES, the ISO 3166 code is ES, and the drive on the right side of the far road. Okay, so this is the map of Spain. And as we can see, Spain used to be a very big empire, of course, pretty well all of the Americas. At one point in another, Spain controlled it, even the Brazilian coast, which they were made during the Iberian Union. Pretty well all of North America, Central America, and these areas, Western Sahara. A lot and a lot of cities, I guess, in India, Africa, maybe Indonesia. And yeah, and of course also in Europe, so yeah, which means Spain has always been like a top dog. One time it was the top dog in power, now it's in tourism. Spain is 
a member of the singing area, the Eurozone, and the European single market. Here we have a graph of the population pyramid in Spain. As you can see, this would grow very huge at 35 to 40 percent. Let's go back, and as you can see, uh, numbers are pretty high. Till the numbers suddenly gradually increase. Yeah, that's a pretty big. These are the biggest cities in Spain. I don't even want to pronounce them. My head is already hurting, and I'm not going to pretend I know how to speak them. Here we have a population graph of Spain, and as we can see, pretty well everyone lives in the western coast. And there's like Catalonia, Valencia, Madrid, and pockets in here. Yes, but this pocket is pretty big, I don't know why. And islands are so pretty densely populated. But it is actually an island who just heard in the news, like there was a volcanic eruption, or I don't remember which was Canary Island, I don't remember what was the name of it, unfortunately. Like suddenly the lava started came out of the floor, and that really sucks. Here we have a map of the population of the languages in Spain, the majority of the population speaks Spanish, of course. Mm, our people speak Galician in these areas, of course, and all of in these areas at the border of Portugal. These speak Astur Leonese. These speak Basque. This area speak Occitan. This area speak Argonese. And these areas speak Catalan. Yeah, Spain is pretty diverse in religion and in languages but they but they are not like foreign okay they are from spain now oh, let's see more and i guess that's it maybe Here we have a population map of population graph of Spain. As you can see, in 1960, there are 30 million people. Now there are 46.94 as of 2019, two years ago. You can see there would be a huge spike in population in 2002 when there were 41 million. Till. 2009, when there would be 36 million, 6 million, 6 million new people would be admitted to Spain. I don't know. Divide their births, for the immigrants, I don't know. You can see it used to be the country with the highest population before, but then France swept it. Spain population grew by 16 million people from 1916, France by 21 million. And Italy by 10 million, which is the lowest. But hey, and we are the second most country, the population top three. The point of population will go crazy, apparently, as from only two years, the population would be like 1 million new people would be added in 2014. I guess that would be thanks to the European migrant crisis. Here we have map of the Spain fertility rate. As we can see, it is widely different. At that time, France used to have the lowest of them all. Now it has the highest of them all. In 2014, it was actually two two children per woman. In 2014, now it has declined. The population, the fertility graph would have significantly declined after 1976 as it would decline literally every year and it has been fun children for a long time it would be at its lowest during this year at 1990 only 1.13 children it would take, uh, go up at its peak at 1.45 in 2008 and after 2000 with the european economic crisis go low as 27 see a very peak 1.34 and is low at 1.26 but it, at least it is not as low as it once used to be it is comparable to the fertility year of 1993 
and here we have a spin GDP as you can see it would have peak from only 12 billion US dollars to 1.393 trillion US dollars as you can see France and Italy and they would also have seen the degrees at the same thing you know like population increase decline very low at its at their peak spins a peak of 1.6225 trillion dollars in 2008 apparently 2007 it was very good years until 2009 2010 yeah they were not the best years apparently see a very high growth from this to this like in only like in only like eight seven to eight years the GDP would have like doubled it but they are still the lowest as it has a higher and france has a higher but just depends on how much population you have that's it for today if you enjoyed the video click the like button share this video with your family and friends and if you have not already subscribe to my channel i will see you in the next video bye